Uh, today I am talking about the Fourier series with regard to some problems. In the last class already I have explained about the introduction of the Fourier series, etc. So, given the function fx, if I can write it in the form a0 by 2 plus sigma an cos n by x by l plus sigma b n sin n by x by l when the function is defined in the interval alpha less than or equal to x less than or equal to alpha plus 2 pi then we are finding the values of a0, an, bn after finding the values of a0, an, bn if we can substitute in star the problem is finished now suppose let us take a first example f x is equal to x square given interval is minus pi less than or equal to x less than or equal to plus pi now as usual what is l? l is equal to upper limit minus lower limit divided by 2 what is the upper limit? this plus pi minus lower limit what is the lower limit? minus pi divided by 2 I repeat l is equal to upper limit it is plus pi minus lower limit what is the lower limit? minus pi divided by 2 so if you calculate 2 pi by 2 2 to cancels pi now let us find the values of these constants a0, an, bn and then let us substitute in star if you find the value of a0 that is it is given by the formula a0 is equal to 1 by l alpha to alpha plus 2 by fx dx now 1 by l what is l? l is 5 observe l is 5 I have it that integral ok I will do it so that you can understand a0 is equal to what is the formula? 1 by l 1 by l what is l? l is 5 right integral given limits alpha to alpha plus 2 pi what is alpha to alpha plus 2 pi? these limits minus 5 to plus 5 minus 5 to plus 5 fx fx means given problem x square dx so 1 by pi now integral of x square x cube by 3 what are the limits? minus pi to plus pi so therefore a0 that becomes equal to 1 by pi this 3 you can take it outside 1 by 3 pi into substitute x is equal to upper limit that is pi x is equal to pi pi cube minus substitute x is equal to lower limit that is minus pi minus pi whole cube so therefore this becomes this is minus pi cube minus of minus plus pi cube pi cube plus pi cube 2 pi cube 2 pi cube divided by 3 pi so 2 by 3 right pi cube by pi pi square so this is the value of a naught so you are substituting the value of a naught data after finding the values of a naught a and b n we are substituting in star so what I got a naught is equal to 2 by 3 pi square very important point all students used to commit mistake while finding L. Yeah. What is L? Yeah? Upper limit, that is pi, minus lower limit. What is lower limit? This minus pi divided by 2. So pi minus of minus pi, 2 pi. 2 pi by 2, L is equal to pi. Just substitute in the formula. Alpha to alpha plus 2 pi means, alpha to alpha plus 2 pi means, this given interval in the problem. In the problem, whatever the interval is given, that you are writing it here and you are integrating it. So you got the value of A naught. Now let us find similarly the value of a n. What is a n? a n it is equal to what is the formula? 1 by n. Given limits or I shall say first value the formula alpha to alpha plus 2 by f x into cos of n by x by n dx. So 1 by l, I told you already, I have already found the value of l. What is l? Upper limit by s over limit divided by 2, l is equal to pi, 1 by pi. Alpha to alpha plus 2 pi, that means given limits. Alpha to alpha plus 2 pi means given limits in the problem. By given interval, minus pi to plus pi. Right, fx means the given problem, that is x square into cos of L by x that is divided by L value we substitute by dx. So this pi pi cancels. So therefore a n that is equal to 1 by pi minus pi to plus pi x square into this pi pi cancels cos an x 
cos and x dx. So this is first function, this is second function, or you can call this a u. Now we have to do Bernoulli's integration. What is that Bernoulli's integration? 1 by 5 into. Now what is the procedure? First function, x square. If you write the first term, all the other terms you will write very easily. First function x square into integral of second. This is second. U, V. This is first. This is second. Integral of cos and x. What is integral of cos and x? Sin and x. Divided by number behind x. L, I repeat. First function x square into integral of cos and x. Sin and x. Divided by number behind x. L minus. Differentiate the first product. 2x. Always you are differentiating the first product. Always you are integrating the second product. Remember, differentiate the first product. 2x. Integrate the second product. Minus cos nx. Integral of sign. Minus cos nx. Right? Divided by n. This n multiply to n. That is n square. Next. Plus. Plus. Differentiate 2x, 2, integrate this, differentiate the first product, 2, integrate this, minus, integral of cos, sin n x, divided by, number of n x, n, this n multiplied to n square, n q. Now, next, differentiation of the first product, 2, that is, 0. What are the limits? x is equal to, minus pi 2, plus pi x is equal to minus pi to plus pi. Note the point sin n pi 0. Sin n minus pi that is also 0. Sin n put x is equal to plus pi sin n pi 0. Keep x is equal to minus pi sin n minus pi that is also 0. So therefore this first term reduces to 0. Similarly last term sin n pi 0. Sin n of minus pi 0. So this also reduces to so what is the meaning? Plus, minus of minus plus, 2x plus x by n square. So therefore, an becomes, an it is equal to, an is equal to 1 by 5, 1 by 5, now 2 minus n, that is plus 2x, cos n x plus 2x cos n x by n square by n square limits from minus pi to plus pi so x is equal to minus pi to x is equal to plus pi so now so that, therefore the n is equal to 1 by pi 2 by n square is constant so therefore 2 by pi n square so what is the name? x into cos n x so substituting x is equal to minus pi x is equal to plus pi so therefore a n becomes 2 by pi n square multiply by put x is equal to pi pi into put x is equal to pi cos n pi minus keep x is equal to lower limit x is equal to minus pi, minus of minus plus pi, cos n of minus pi. I have already told you cos n pi value is cos n pi. What will value? Minus 1 to the power n. Similarly, cos of minus n pi, that is also minus 1 to the power n. So therefore, a n is equal to 2 by pi n square. Now, cos n pi, if I take it as common factor, otherwise pi into, right? This is minus 1 to the power n, this is plus pi into, cos n of minus pi, minus, cos n pi only, that is also minus 1 to the power n. Now, take minus 1. So, therefore, a n becomes 2 by pi n square, this pi cancels with pi, because if I take pi as common factor, pi cancels with this pi. So what is it mean? 2 into minus 1 to the power n take us as an is equal to 2 by n square 2 by n square now minus 1 to the power n 
Here minus 1 to the power n. So there are minus 1 to the power n plus minus 1 to the power n. 2 into minus 1 to the power n. So totally what you are getting? An is equal to 4 into minus 1 to the power n by n square. Similarly, you calculate the value of bn, that becomes 0. If you calculate the value of bn, that becomes 0, you do it. Right? Well, later I will tell you how I am able to tell bn is equal to 0 without calculation. Right? Later I will tell that. So, you got the value of given in a n and b n, substitute in star, that is fx is equal to a r by 2 plus sigma a n cos n pi x by l plus sigma b n sin n pi x by l. Okay, let us stop at this point.